Your girl is a Taurus sun. Focus on your peace, moving forward. If it shows up half-baked, half-cooked, half-made, half-ready, release it. Period. Stop forcing shit that's no one. Ain't gonna hold nobody. Ain't gonna fake shit, ain't gonna hold shit, ain't gonna make shit up. I love what I do. Cause I'm tap the fuck in. I'ma read this motherfucking course yeah. left, right, up, down, sideways, sideways. Tap the fuck in. You hear me? Yeah, I read Mirror it. two. Tap the fuck Backwards in. In reverse. Yeah. I'ma read these bitches. Hello, Taurus gang. Welcome to your Taurus season bonus read. I hope you all are well and turning up for y'all's birthdays okay thank you all for your birthday wishes it is a 5-1 for those that are early and um i hope y'all are enjoying y'all's birthday for sure let's see for taurus what is the birthday season messages anything you need to know about me is down below if you know her welcome let's see what the spirit wants you to know thank y'all again for y'all support for Taurus, what's the team? We got the Nine of Cups and the Okay, the Knight of Pentacles. Somebody say you they wish, Taurus. Okay. <laughs> they could be headed your way. He about to pluck that pinnacle out the tree. Let me go on and grab this. I've been saving this. Okay, and pour into you, or this is you. Hmm. Let's see. What else for Taurus? What's the energy? Some of y'all could be drinking a little bit. It's clouding your focus. Oh, somebody in love, child. Um, yeah, dedication here. You need to stay focused. Now, with this Ace of Pentacles, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, it's giving everything you ever wanted in love, a renewal in love, opening your heart up to love. Ace of Cups is love. It's also healing. It's pregnancy. Some of y'all need to watch out with the pleasure of the Nine of Pentacles. I mean, nine of cups, nine of pentacles. Some of y'all could be single and mingling, child. Nine of cups, okay? Dealing with a Virgo or Pisces, though, for some of you, or they have that in their birth chart. I feel like someone wants to renew something with you for some of you. Some of you are falling in love. You're taking it slow. You're trying to. Let's see. What else for Taurus? What's the energy? Somebody guarded. This masculine is guarded. King of Cups to the Four of Pentacles. All this masculine won't release you for you feminine energies. Or this person is really, really trying to figure out how to express themselves. Ace of Cups, King of Cups. Okay. Mm, what else for Taurus? For some of y'all, I just got out of that water sign reading Cancer. And there's a masculine that won't stop, can't stop, refuse to stop. Holding on to somebody, he won't back, and they living a life crazy. What else for Taurus? Night of Wines, getting brave. Some of y'all moving too fast, or so this person's just gonna go for it. Queen of Cups, King of Cups, ooh Lord. There's a telepathic, magnetic, strong bond. It's hot and heavy in the middle of you, motherfucker. Y'all is calling each other. What's that Kim song? When love calls your name. Yes. Child, listen. The Knight of Wands in between. Hold on. Y'all can't see that. The Knight of Wands is in between two soulmates. Like, very intuitive. Like, real mellow. Compassionate. Loving healers. This is twin flame energy for some of you. Y'all are both healers with this water. Okay. Water here. Y'all got y'all own dominion over healing others. Child, this is deep. There's a lot of sexual chemistry too. It's giving telepathic sex for some of y'all. How y'all do that? Teach me. <laughs> Y'all dealing with a Scorpio for some of y'all with Drake on this TV to my in too deep. I know that's right. All this water, the chariot, that go that cancer. I'm telling y'all. Now, somebody coming towards y'all for some of y'all. I got heavy water. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces on steroids right here. And three of cups is a third party interference. For some of y'all, reconciliation or it's raining in somebody's family or somebody got childhood trauma. Why I say that? I'm just going to say the Ten of Cups is, could be family or symbolic for a relationship or a happy, blissful outcome. But it's raining, so it ain't what they thought it was. Yep, that's why they started cheating and juggling you. Okay, well, this you playing around. Some of y'all, they trying to explore their options for a lot of you. Okay. Somebody, y'all can know somebody named Kina. Okay. Sakina, Lakina, Akina. Let's clarify. 
For Taurus, what's the energy? It's giving nostalgia and memories. Six of Cups, past life soulmate. I'm telling y'all, Scorpio energy. Some of y'all dealing with a twin or a strong soulmate, like it say. Some of y'all, <laughs> some of y'all's past keep coming back to hunt y'all. Okay, they want you back. I'm telling you, that's the Ace of Cups, Ace of Water, healing or renewal in love for some of you. New love for some of you. Compassion, king and queen of cups. Emotions. This connection is built off emotions. Y'all have an emotional connection. Or if it's not an emotional connection, it's very understanding and heartfelt and compassionate. It's like y'all built a connection based on moral support, emotional support. Y'all connected on a deep level. It's not wands it's not sex and passion and ambition it's love what's this nine of cups what's over or it will be to me i got new love y'all listen y'all done help this person to open their heart or they helped you to open up it says heart chakra opening compassion happiness truth revealed compassion and then these two compassionate beings i feel like you've taught this person how to love again yeah, they, now for some of y'all, they could be pulling back or they already did. It says emotional or physical distance, retreat, time out, wanting time alone energy. They could have pulled back from you in order to process or they had something else going on. Belief systems. Here's our energy with this evaluating long held beliefs. They could be married for some of you or they're worried about like image, like y'all live a certain lifestyle, livelihood that's different than theirs. They thinking about some, could be religion, spirituality versus you could have a lot of kids they thought maybe they only wanted to be with one woman and their child this person's but, but they're processing they're like damn everything i thought i knew yeah no what's the knight of pentacles for taurus what is you the knight of pentacles is i told y'all somebody coming y'all way soulmate energy lover's card integration proposal what <laughs> then i say he said let me get this about this tree i've been saving this somebody is thinking about longevity if they're not about to flat out get down on one knee they think you or it for them or this is you and they want to take it slow because they want long term there's a tree here and there's a tree here a little birdie told me they about to bring you this pinnacle <laughs> or oh, this you gemini energy with the lovers it's like integration of yin and yang let's not skip that that's twin and flame flame okay look at danelle y'all know i love yin and yang if y'all on this channel okay y'all been here a minute you know what's crazy it's a little yin and yang symbol right here bow it's a twin for a lot of you headed your way for union it didn't say reunion it say union like this this is that for some of y'all y'all are getting ready to get in a brand new connection and it ain't no regular regular it's a twin get ready for a rock and roll relationship <laughs> i'm not talking shit sometimes in my experience, some twins don't have that turbulence. Like, it ain't with all their traumas and their triggers. It just be like, well, not the ghost thing. But you may trigger them to want to change some things, clean up some things, be their best self. And that's a trigger. They may pull back. Like, oh, shit, I got to get my shit together. Sometimes it's like, damn, you ghosted me for what? You ignored me for five, six hours for what? Like, y'all a beef like that, too. But let me not get into the whole twin flame thing. Because some of y'all dealing with a so mate and that's fine too they hit it your way <laughs> ace of cups like it said ace of cups oh this shoe what's the ace of cups why they feel like they're not good enough run it back five of pentacles that's you tourists masculine ouch toxicity hmm I just got a sharp pain, bro. Like, what the fuck was that? Okay, so it's a logical, confident, assertive, protective, wounded, controlling, aggressive ego on the downside. But they feel like they're not good enough with this Ace of Cups. What? 
not feeling enough, missing someone, five of pentacles, left out in a cult. They got to heal from this. Oh, they have to heal from loss, wounds, and rejection. Or this is you. Or you're helping them heal. You're helping them to step into their masculine energy. Or you have been stepping into your masculine energy. However they go. Based on this healing journey. So for some of y'all, y'all are already here. Empowered heart. <laughs> Integrating. Y'all, integration don't look like, oh, like a golden light. It just feel like a golden light. Like y'all are already mixing and mending and blending. And like it says integrating and that is helping them helping you heal just by interacting with each other oh for some of you yeah they got some toxic trait or they got a lot of fear with the devil and the moon someone's doing black magic to stop and block this connection someone's working on building their stability so that they can feel stable solid on their own as they should as you should but someone's behind the scenes trying to slow that down oh if they don't feel stable if they don't feel competent if they don't feel ready if they don't feel like they got what they need they're not going to give this person this pinnacle they're not going to commit let me fuck up their finances by projecting and sending negative energy and wishing on their downfall and causing delays and obstacles in their life so they won't commit to that person it's a hated behind the scenes right there it say things are not as they appear somebody may think oh i lost my job because it is oh my shit failed because it is oh oh no it's black magic it's real. What's this Four of Pentacles for? Tour. I get mad. Haters. What's this alchemy? <laughs> Same card that came out of cancer. Hold on, y'all. Let me see. Is there any spell work with this alchemy right here? Somebody put something on you, like a root, demonic attachment in order to hold you back or hold on to you. Hold on, y'all. Let me see. For my deeply spiritual folk, let me see what this is. Any spell work connected to this? Oh, it's peaceful. It's a family member. Okay, spirit say, look, it's say a family, a close circle, a family member is connected guys ancestors and all that and then it said ancestors right here my team telling me relax it ain't okay okay for some of y'all y'all spirit team y'all's ancestors with alchemy and epiphany is trying to get you to transmute this negative energy to heal it to flip it to bop it to stop it release this though right here it says four of pentacles which is blocked heart chakra holding back you're being empowered. You're being guided. You're being lit, uplifted by your person, by your guides, by your ancestors, by, by the Lord to heal. Because you deserve love and so does the person you're spiritually connected to. But if you're the person they're spiritually connected to, then you got to heal so that the two of you can both experience love in this lifetime. It's a mutual thing. You heal, they heal. They heal, you heal. But somebody got to heal. You got to keep going. Release the toxicity. When you see a bitch is toxic, when you see a dude is toxic, do not engage. It's slowing you down. King of Cups. Present day focusing on desires. King of Cups. This King of Cups is... <laughs> Please go watch Cancer's bonus read. Because this came out. This King of Cups is sending envy. Evil eye, negative energy. For some of y'all dudes, massive energy that's watching, your person, your spiritual person, their ex... Is into the into the arts, into the stuff. They with the shits. For some of you women, your ex is with the shits. For some of y'all, this is friends hating, sending you negative energy. Could be a water sign, don't have to be. For a lot of you, for a handful of you, this King of Cups is watching you heavy because they're in love with you. Okay. <laughs> Anything spiritual here? King of Cups. King of Cups. Go watch Cancer reading. One more. King of Cups. This is this is this is what came out for Cancer's reading. King of Cups. That, okay, last one. You need spiritual supplies. Some of y'all need to stock up. Last one. Okay, and call on your spirit team. 
Some of y'all could work with this person. They are harassing you in your dream state with this spiritual gift that they have. Doing readings on you, stalking and watching. They've been doing it for months or it's been longer than months. You need to call on help spiritual help before you go to bed at night with dream state harassment this person is stalking watching blocking all kind of shit please go watch that cancer reading trying to cause a stalemate between you and your person y'all may think y'all life is just having regular mishaps it's not spiritual warfare is real i found out the hard way by getting attacked not wise. For some of y'all, this person is in this sexual only situation because they're not ready to let their past go. They got marriage going on. They got other shit going on. They're living their best life. They're not ready to settle down. Or they've been really reevaluating. They've been evaluating all that. Evaluating long-held beliefs. They take the they took the mask off and they look, they're taking a look at themselves. Facade. They're pretending. They're getting social media likes and they're getting attention. They have groupies. They have a fan base. All of this, that, and a third. They in their head. They're like, damn. Why am I acting like something that I'm not? I really, really am ready to settle down. But they've been in this Knight of Wands energy. Now, for some of you, this is being brave. Knight of Wands is also a hero, bravery, in order to take action to shift something. What's the outcome of Knight of Wands? Taurus. Awesome. I said, what's the outcome? A happy outcome. Child, tap the fucking. What's the outcome? A happy one. Turn up. Turn up. What's this queen? <laughs> That's going to work out. In... Oh, shit. That's going to work out in your favor. The first quote we started with. Nine of cups. Nine of cups. Look at that. Will you look at that? This is going to work out in your favor. What's the queen of cups? The queen of cups is the, the feminine. So here's here. What's this? Very successful and abundant. She's also spiritually gifted. The Queen of Cups is also a clairvoyant. Yep. Very psychic, intuitive, very warm and nurturing, a healer. Anyways, here's something. This is a twist. For some of you, there's a soulmate bond. You are a soulmate to two people. Meaning, the person is stalking and watching. You were mated to them. That was your soulmate. But you're also mated to this actual partner. For some of you men, same situation. You're this person's other half, but they also had a soul connection to someone else that won't release them. That's why it's a, it's a match regardless. But I also have a higher, a bigger match. The yin and the motherfucking yang. Just like this. Integration of yin and yang. There they go. They came out together. So you know what I feel? She is that queen of cups, which was made it with this king of cups. Yeah, they had a connection. But she's also equally yoked to her other half. So this person is on this soulmate energy right here. They both here. And that situation is a twin flame energy, yin and yang. The, the soulmate won't release on your side, on their side. Now for you men, you can have a that won't let you go either she might be playing with the voodoo and your her and putting your name in her drawers and hoping praying and wishing and want her family back I ain't gonna drop all the jews that these bitches be doing but just become spiritually aware and be like no i don't want the stomo i don't want this i'm over this i'm not going back i'm not gonna keep hoping and praying and wishing thinking i can fix my family because that'd be people trying to manifest you back we can fix it shit like that I'm saying a lot that I shouldn't be saying because people be doing this bullshit. So for you men, you need to become spiritually aware, like for real, because women be out here doing this shit. But like I said, a lot of you, y'all need to watch that cancer reading because cancer was over there trying to stop and block a divine feminine from moving forward to be with her divine counterpart and just moving forward regardless because he didn't want to be left out in the cold or he was in his ego. He couldn't stand the fact that the woman had become successful without him. Yeah. If you cross watching, go somewhere. This shall read until next time. Peace.